So we're in um, Prince of Wales Island at our log yard, and so all the primary breakdown happens here. My, my eldest son is Brent Jr. and Ryan, two years younger only. They've been uh, very uh, crucial in the, the buildup of Alaska Specialty Woods. These guys work hard breaking these logs up into blocks that we use to resaw into soundboards. One of the first jobs that they did, these guys had a backpack and Ryan would get the little ones. He was about, yeah, maybe eight and Brent then would have been ten. Oh, I greatly appreciate it. There's a lot more to it than just going out and cutting down any old green tree that you can find, you know. I mean, those trees are beautiful enough as just standing the way they are, you know, and there's plenty of laying on the ground, you know. Just go out and get it. It's a valuable resource and it's going away fast. Seeing instruments that came from our wood, it changes its perspective. We're out here just busting every day, seeing the, the instruments, the quality of the instruments, you know. Not only that, but it's a guitar. It makes beautiful, beautiful music. Change somebody's world. It's pretty cool. What old growth habitat is, is a range of growth that is from seedling to old age, died of old age, and everything in between. Well, whether it's the bugs or the moss or the flora, it's all together. It is no doubt that, you know, we're harvesting trees at a faster rate than it's growing. And when you're talking a tree that averages, and this old growth that we're using for soundboard production averages 400 years old. Timber production are working on a rotation of a 90-year cycle from harvest to harvest again. There is no soundboard production in that, in that 90 years. By salvaging, um, we get to utilize the old growth material it is needed for the products that we produce without detriment to what's what's alive and what's what's for the future. 